is Wizzle's Fishing and Boating Adventures. Featuring Captain Taco. Featuring RJ. And featuring CC. <laughs> this adventure is the sharks, redfish, crabbing, and symbiotic relationship. We're right now going to the rocks, which is sort of offshore, but not too far. You can still see land. We're going to try to catch some redfish and maybe something else. We don't know. Right now, me and my brother are catching cannonballs, which are also known as cannonball jellyfish. This is a cannonball jellyfish, and um, it will not sting you. And right here, there is a symbiotic, symbiotic relationship between a crab and a jellyfish. You see, the crab gets protection, and the jellyfish gets clean. Um, this crab is right now huge. I've never seen one this big. It's quite big. Let's see. It, it cleans and helps out the jellyfish, but it does not hurt it. The jellyfish helps it keep shelter for it. It's quite a big crab. Now I have to let it go. Ah! Keep the crab! The crab hurts! Keep the crab! The crab has these special tentacles, uh, special claws, to make sure it doesn't hurt the jellyfish, but it hurts humans. So keep I'm... the crab! RJ wants to keep the crab because he wants to play with it, but I tell you, I'm gonna let the crab have his relationship. He's having a pretty good life right now. Yeah. That's nasty. That was my fish. Raleigh was just helping me reel it in, showing me the right way. You'll see me in a second how I reel it in. Thank you very much. We called my shark Fatty because he would not get in the net. It took a little while for him. He did not want to be caught. <laughs> he is a fatty. Come on, Dad, pick it up. Come on. Yes. <laughs> that does not want to be caught right now. Okay, you don't see me much after the shark's in there, only my hands, but I totally drop the rod and start touching, okay? Now, you can stroke a shark's skin backwards, like going up, but it hurts. Doing it the right way, putting it down, feels much better. Okay, I bet you don't won't believe this, but I triple dog dared myself to pick up a shark. Wait for it. I picked up a shark. Proof. Wait till like, this is how I revive a shark. This is how I do it. My way is called throwing it back in the water. Now we're going to the Edisto Marina, where we do bunches of stuff, especially eat ice cream and go crabbing. It's so much fun. It's chicken necks for crab bait. May I open them? And uh, this, I wish, I wish this okay. is the crab net. You should also keep a Swiss Army knife or an Army knife around, so just in case you have to cut any lines or anything. The reason I'm wearing long pants and a long sleeve jacket with my hoodie on is because of the sand gnats. Now sand gnats are not just regular gnats that bug you. They're even worse. They bite you. I must say the blue crab we caught for the first time was quite an excitement, but he's a feisty one. Me and Charlie put out a crab net and we weren't expecting to get anything big, but we actually got this really big blue crab um, I don't know if it's he or she, but right now I'm calling it a he because it has these uh, pinchers. Right here you can find out that apparently he had done something to clip off with his um, claw. He's going to be eaten. Yep. He's in the boiling pot now. 
Too bad, so sad. Wee wee. Now we're heading back out to the rocks. Redfish! Come on, Dad, we all my fishing! Woo! That's Raleigh's rod, but sometimes you need the dad to do the work. Number one. All right, Dad, come on. We want to see what it is. This is also Raleigh's. His line's pretty lucky, I must say. My mom's trying to make a fish revive. Dead, 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 dead. Ready for it? Don't think it's gonna come alive? Bye-bye. This is the third red fish, but this time I don't let dad fight it. I fight it myself. I can't believe this. We have to turn back if you wanna see this. Okay, I'll take the hook. Maya was actually pretty unique out of the most of them. Spot-tailed bass or redfish are usually have one spot, but mine had a few trickles. <laughs> okay. Stay tuned for the next adventure. Whizzle! <laughs>